Could you live here? Located in the hustle and bustle of downtown Lancaster, Pennsylvania, this farmhouse dates back to 1805. When you cross the street and step onto the property, it's almost as if you are stepping back in time, like time stood still on this little farm. A time when you wake up in the morning to the sound of a rooster crowing outside your window. You stumble out to the cucumber pump to haul in buckets of water so you can wash and make breakfast. Then off to chores where you collect eggs and milk the goats and cows. Knock out the stalls where you wheel the barrow of manure across the aisle and into the awaiting spreader. Walking across the wooden boards of the loft to collect hay for feeding and then to the silo for fodder as well. Once you are done with breakfast and chores, then your day really begins. If you are a child, you would walk to the one-room schoolhouse with the wood stove providing the only source of heat. Not a school bus, light switch, or computer in sight. You won't be Googling any answers here. If you're an adult, you may head to the Snitz house to dry fruits and vegetables for your family to eat during winter months. Spending your day pressing cider or chopping meat for sausage or bologna, and your evening sewing pieces of fabric for a colorful quilt by candlelight. Or perhaps to the woodworking shop to craft furniture or small tchotchkes to sell, but you won't hear the whine of the router or the whir of the drill. Maybe you head to the lime kiln to burn limestone and shells into lime for use as mortar, for gardening, or whitewashing. The trees bordering the roads were whitewashed to increase nighttime visibility and to protect the trees from insect damage. Or perhaps the smith shop to bend iron into kitchen utensils, wagon wheels, tools, or horseshoes. But the shop can be a bit dark without electricity to light your work and certainly hot on summer days without the relief of a fan. This 15-acre farmstead includes a schoolhouse, a craft market, and a variety of animals to learn about and tend to. A simpler time, some would say, but without the convenience of modern electricity, could you live here?